In the units of measure, if your business is tracking things that they have in inventory, units of measure is the way in which you track items. So for example, if I am tracking something like coffee bags, uh, which I sell as a product, maybe on my website, I would track them by pieces or maybe by units. Or perhaps if I am producing coffee in bulk, I would save it as kilograms in one state as a semi-finished good or a type of product that I sell to wholesalers. Um, and variety of different ways in which you would track items, whether it's volumetric, whether it's by the units, or whether it's by lengths, or even in some cases square square meters or square feet, which is common in like leather and textile. On this location or on this page, this is where you would upload those different units of measures. Um, you can also you can add them here. You can additionally remove them from here. And further th further to that, anytime you add a material or product, which we'll cover in later videos, you'll be able to add the new ones there as well which will then populate this page here in your settings page.